don't have to. So I agree with you do more you drown. Would you drown if somebody threw you in the water? Yeah, you can't swim. My dad couldn't swim. I never learned. Yeah, my dad fell. And he said when he was in the army, the guys picked him up and the girls were like, he didn't know. She was standing up and she was going, I said, what, what do I do? There, there's green drugs that's in the store. <laughs> she must have been bringing me something. Is that the store? Yeah. Did you go off? Yeah. No. It went off here. And I, I had started my life spinning when that went off. Hey, son, hey. <laughs> Are you laughing at me, Tony? Oh, my. Yes, as I started the live stream, my sis got up. How are you today, guys? It's great to see you. I think I remember to turn my volume up here. Let me double check. Yeah, I did for once. Well... There is always something when you live stream, isn't there? 
we have here not the great gamer welcome and of course we have the squirrel hey look squirrel tony who's laughing at me we have gina b navinci hey son hey and we have ghana hey son hey for those of you who were in my live stream on my other channel last night, you know what tonight's topic is going to be. Let me ask you guys, we have guests in the house and they are sitting in the room next door. Is that too loud? Do I need to turn my microphone down a bit or... What do you think? Let me know in the chat. Where is the teacher's pet? Well, I don't know. I don't have any, but I have the teacher's coffee. As I said, it sounds good, great. I got a little thrown off here by that interruption. As you could see, I had made a little welcome sign here that says, hey son, hey. And that's part of my new merch. So let's get into today's topic. I want to introduce to you Google Groups. If you have been around for a while, you know that I love the Google ecosystem and all the things it offers, but I hadn't heard about Google Groups. I just, by chance, when I was looking over all the Google apps and services, found it. And I am both impressed and underwhelmed. I am still learning, so don't expect a full tutorial today. But if there is an interest, I will do tutorials about this website later on. Today, I just want to show you. So let's start by putting my screen up here. This is how it looks when you first go to the website. It's groups.google.com. And as you can see, I'm not a member of any groups here yet. What groups is, is it can be either an email list, a mailing list, or it can be a discussion forum. If you don't have any groups yet. You can search and a group can be either public or it can be a closed group. On my other account, I have set up two groups. One I have set up just as an email list where I can send out monthly emails to and everybody that subscribes to it. The second one I have set up is in form of a discussion forum. And I will show you both of them very soon. But first, let's, let me show you how you can find groups. You go to groups google.com and up on this side and here under the search bar you can search my groups or all groups and messages. 
I'm going to search under all groups and messages. The first search word I'm going to use is YouTube. And let's see what's happening here. Not very much. It's searching and searching. No. Let's reload that page again. Let's try one more time. Don't tell me that my internet went. Well, you can search groups or conscience. It's very slow right now. I'm sorry. I am. I have actually ordered a new internet that will come in hopefully next week and this will be a little here we have YouTube groups with <coughs> YouTube connected to them in and one form or another and this is not very fast normally it shows had activity or not so these are groups that or talk. Now we're going to search for, and if this works right, two groups would show up here when Chrome has done its job. And that will be the two groups that I have created on my other account. And here they are, Pixelpia, which is the discussion forum, and it says here we can discuss anything anything and everything connected to YouTube and the internet. And the other one is Pixapian News, a mailing list where you get all the latest news about what's happening on Pixelpia. Mm. If anybody is interested in joining any of these groups, all you do, of course, you can search for other. I use my groups as an example. At the right side here is like a little door with an arrow. If I click that, it says ask to join Pixel PM. And I would ask and ask to join Pixel PM News. I don't know if I actually did ask. Or maybe my internet is too slow. But let's go over here. This is the account where I have these two groups. So let's start by looking at pick a little. And let me see, pen members. No, there is pending members. So it didn't send it. Why here? Now ask to join Pixel Pia. And I ask to link to my Google profile. I can choose that or not. And I can click that off and just call myself Pia. I can subscribe to every new message, daily summaries, combined updates, on, or don't send any updates. And subscribe me to email updates when I post to a conversation. So if I am part of any thread there and someone else <clears throat> writing anything in that thread, in that email thread, I will get a message. And just because is my reason. And I'm asking to join. Now let's do the same for the other one. And that one can be linked to my account profile, every new message and 
want to know my reason for at, asking to join Pixel Pia News. So that's how easy I could join group. Now, if we go back here, no, not a new conversation. Go back here to my groups. And first we look at Pixel Pia. I should probably refresh the site. I have two pending members. Ooh, Ghana, cause I can, and me, cause, so let's approve myself and Ghana. So now I have three versions of myself. I set up two just because I needed to test it and Ghana. And this is in the Pixapia, the forum discussion. Pixapia news. I should, I think Ghana was fast and signed up for that one too. This is a little different and I will show you in what way this group is different. When you create a group, <laughs> hi James, for yourself. You see, I have created two groups here. I will create a new group that I will delete in a very short time, but just to show you how it works. Test group. And then we get a specific email for this group. In this case, test group at googlegroups.com. Just a test. Next. Test group Pixel Pia, because test group was taken. <clears throat> Who can search for group? who can search for the group, just group members, only invite users, anyone can ask or anyone can join. In the two cases I showed you from the group I have created, I used anyone can ask. And I said, anyone on the web can search for the group. This time I just leave it as is. Who can view conversations? group owners, group managers, group members, or anybody on the web who can post same alternatives and who can view members. And I always set that to group manager. And then I can add members and managers here and welcome message. I can write something here, but I still have to redo that later and how to subscribe. Each email, digest, abridged, or no email. Create group. It asked me if I'm a robot, and I don't think I am. So let's create this group. What went wrong there? I need to add member, maybe. Group creation failed because, what did it say? Because you are I am what? Oh, I'm over your quota. I can only create two groups. Okay. Sorry about that. 
let's go in and look at Pixel Pia. And after you have created your group, you can go down to settings here. You first have the general settings, like the name of the group, the group email, and your little introduction. That was the part that you saw here. This part, welcome message. And here you can do some uh, formatting if you want to. Right now I'm not gonna talk about collaborative inbox and all of that. I enabled shared labels because eventually I will create labels for this group. One label for uh, graphic discussion, one for YouTube discussion and so forth. Who can see the group? Here I have set to anyone on the web and anyone on the web can ask. Who can view conversations? I set that to just group members because I want people to know that what they say in this group is just for the group. Who can post group members? And who can view members? And that I set to group owners and managers. I don't, I want this because of privacy. If you write something here, you should know that if you are a member here, you should know that no other member can check if you are or not. I'm going to check members catalog. And it's for everyone. Member privacy, here you can choose either display name or Google profile. And I said both were acceptable, but display names must be unique. So if two people sign up with using the same name, one of them has to change it. So first, using a name can use that. Who can contact group owners? Anybody that's a member. Who can view member email addresses? I set that to group manager level just for privacy reasons, so other members cannot go in and find your email if you are a member of this group. I allow email posting. That means that you don't have to go to the website. You can send an email to pixelp at googlegroups.com. Was it Google Groups? googlegroups.com, yes, and it will end up on the website. I also love web posting. So you can go either on this website or via email to write something in the group. Who can rep reply privately to the author? I set that up to group managers. So if one member writes something, the only way for me as a member, not me as an owner, but me as a member, the only way for me to reply to that is to do it in the forum. So I don't, I want people to feel that if I write something that's maybe not the popular opinion, I don't, I don't risk to get 40 emails from people because my email address is protected when I write in this forum. And moderate content is owners and managers, same with metadata and posting as group is only owner and manager. Default sender, I should change that to the group address. So your email address won't show up. No moderation I have set for the message because I think we are all adults, except new members. If your first post you have to get approved, after that it's okay. Spam, I have said, moderate and notify content moderators. I will not send a message to you if you spam. It will just not be published. The prefix for everything will be Pixelpia. 
languages, English. And if I write something, I said sender choose recipient. So you can choose to write something only to me as an owner or make it public for all group members or manager only, group owners only, the author of the message only. That is not possible because I have said that members can't write that or a customer address, not possible either. A member moderation. So this is all the settings you can do. So let's take a look. I didn't save that. Save changes and go back and look at the group. We have no conversations yet. I'm going to write this conversation just on the website. I could do it as a group. And you see it is from pixelpia at googlegroups.com. First message. Welcome, everybody. Remember to be polite and treat everyone with respect and post message. So here we see the first message. And now I can choose to reply, write another email here, and that will be from the same address. And eventually I will set up labels. So you will have, let's create the label right away. Add the label and this is new members and we have to write with a little underscore and let's add that label to this what am i doing here go back and refresh Mark that and add a label, new members, apply. And now you see there is one little label in front of it. Let's go back to my group. Did I really, squirrel? I can't recall that. Do you have proof? Let's take a look at the other one because this is the one I have set up as a mailing list. So my settings for this is very, very different. The name of the group is Pixapia News and the email address is pixapianews at googlegroups.com. A mailing list where you get all the latest news about what is happening on Pixapia. And then a little welcome message. No additional features. I'm not going to use labels here. Anyone on the web can find, see it and ask to subscribe. View conversations can everybody do, but post and view members is only me and my managers. This is not a group for conversation. This is just functioning as an email list. It's suitable for everyone. That's probably what I called you, Tony. You're part of everyone. 
not adults only. That might be your group. And who can contact group owner? That should actually just be group members. If you get my email list, you should be able to contact me. And this is just set for me so I can write newsletter either using an email or go on the web. Group members can reply to me privately. Nobody can attach files here because this is just for me. And email option, you see here, include the standard groups footer and the standard groups footer. I included a custom footer. It said, sorry to see you go. And then the standard footer is to unsubscribe from this group, send the email to, and then the email address you're sending it to. And to view this message, there is a link to view this message as well. That will be at the end of each email. So people always have the opportunity to unsubscribe. So that was, in short, the Google Groups. It is very empty in my groups so far because I just created them today. I had created one yesterday and someone is really pushing it here. Maybe I said that everybody is adult here. I wouldn't take it back if I said. Uh, can you show how you approve a membership request? I can. I hope. Yes, I can because someone. Oh, here. Gina has applied to my Pixapia. I think it's you, Gina. So I go into people members, pending members. I had one. Oh, I have two. DJ Talks and Gina Bina. Why did it say just one? What I do here is I see DJ Talks all I have to do is look at the little check mark over here. I just click that and you are approved. When my computer decides to there, one request approved. And eventually it will wake up again. And Gina Bina. I'm going to approve you. Don't worry. But I will show here a little X. If I hit that instead, it means you will be rejected. But of course, you are approved. So if I go in here now and look at members, we have Ghana, Gina Bina, we have me, DJ Talks, we have me again, and we have me again. <clears throat> Why is there a little... Email are currently bouncing. Something is not right with your Gina Bina. They can't send it to you for some reason. It says email or okay. I will go in and change this as well. 
because none of you needs to be moderated. Because what you can see here on this side is that I had set it up for being moderated. But you actually... Do I need to do this for everybody? Allowed, allowed, allowed. I guess I have to do it for everybody here. No. Allowed, DJ Talks, Gina Bina, we have to allow you to. You have to check in with your email why it's bouncing. Uh, the reason I didn't give myself permission here is that this one I'm actually going to remove. And if I need to remove a member, Miss Pavins. Anyway, I go into the members list. I click remove, and up here I can remove member. I can ban a member. I can sh change the role of the member. I can change the form, and I change the right to post. But in this, because I don't need. To three accounts in this group. So this is the discussion group. And as I said, let's see. We just have a first message. But it's where we can have discussions of all kinds of topics that has to do with YouTube and internet. And you are all now approved right in the forum. Fun. If you are interested in starting collecting email addresses from you, need a simple email list. There are many companies and many you can set up email list through Twitter, lose, use review. You can set up email at, what's it called? Mail monkey, ship monkey. <laughs> well, all of those. Uh, but if you want a very simple way to set up, a newsletter that you send by mail. Here we have a squirrel. First one on my members list. Used. This is not a form. This is only newsletter. And all I have to do now to send out a newsletter every week or every month, depending on what I have decided how often if something happens and i quickly need to get out information to people that has subscribed to this members list this newsletter i can do it either from the website or right from my phone by sending an email to pixelpia news at googlegroups.com using any software, any email software, and just send it in, and it will be distributed, depending on how the members have set up their... What... Oh, is I'm here... Am I in the right group now? Yeah. Uh, 
Ghana set it up as a bridge. Google's Google <laughs> Squirrel set it up as each email. So depending on how the members have set it up, their email, and as you can see here in my welcome, it's a monthly newsletter. So I won't tire you with 40 emails a day. It will be an email a month. And it will start from July. And it's a really, really easy way to collect email addresses and an easy way to connect with people. Say that something happened. Say that I did something real. Stop sharing this. And you can ask me a question a little later. But say that something, I did something really bad. And YouTube closed down or Google closed down my YouTube channel for any reason. I could write an email to pixelpianews at group, googlegroups.com and get in touch with you. If I did something really, really bad and they cancel my Google account, it would be really impossible because then I can't use Google Groups or any of the other Google apps either. But you know me, I won't do anything that bad. I don't even think I would do something that get me to lose my YouTube channel. But that's why it's important to have a mailing list. What you also can do is you can download, I think, let me see here. Uh, I've selected. No. Yeah, here, download. I can export my members list. <laughs> no, it won't happen. Let me share this again. Here, I have all my members for my news list. And you see this little button here? I can download this. So I have all the members email saved if I should do something really really bad so there you have it before I open up the room here and you are welcome to come on screen if you want to talk about Google Groups, have any thoughts about how it can be used, or anything else. So let me share the link to... No, that's not what I did to share. I wanted to share this and if you want to come on just to hang out that's okay too and while we are waiting let's play some music if I can Connect to my little music player here. Which I can't right now for some reason. There we go. Is it too loud? I'm going to turn it down a little bit 
if it's too loud to be background music. And here we have tonight's first guest. Hey, Bea. Hi, DJ. I bet you could guess where my camera's not on. Hmm. That's not the right one. Uh, Hi, DJ. Hi, Bea. How are you? How are you? Good. How are you? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. So, what do you think about Google Groups? I think it's a great opportunity to connect with new subscribers off the platform and it's a good alternative to let's say Patreon because not everyone can Pay a certain amount of money every month. So doing this is completely free for anyone to join. So that's a great point. <laughs> I agree. And as I said in the beginning, I'm impressed, but I am also disappointed. This looks like, aesthetically, it looks like Internet 1995. And that mm -hmm. is a little bit disappointing, that it's not more modern. I would like to be able to... Uh, set it up a little different maybe change the background color or whatever something a little bit more intriguing but at the same time i must say it's i mean as you said it is free and what else what else do you ask for free i mean we are a little spoiled with everything free on the internet and we want more and more from it. Yep. But I don't know. I think it has potential to be something good. Yeah, much definitely. I, I don't know yet, but I think it's promising. Yeah, I'm... Um... And as you will say before, if you get your YouTube channel shut down, it's a good way to communicate what's going on. So, yeah. Yeah. And that's why I set up two groups. One that is just an email list where I can tell people what's going on, what's happening. Mm -hmm. But I think that the other part, the forum part, if you manage that well and have people that really want to talk about these topics, I think it can be really really interesting to have a group like that because some things you need to talk a lot about and you can't do that in a live stream or 
just in a conversation in the comments. You need to talk longer and deeper and have many people's opinions. So that's what I'm hoping that the forum part yeah. can be. Yeah. And I think it's up to me as the owner of that group to set it up in a way that it touches people and it interests people and people want to talk about these topics. So I need to really get my brain around everything I can do with Google Books. Yeah, I, and I, yeah. you know that I, I just realized what it is. But I will do my best to learn more about it. Yeah, I definitely agree. Now, this question just came to mind. But do you know if we could integrate this with Google Sites? I am not sure. I am shortly coming back to Google Sites again when it comes to tutorial and I will most certainly look into that because that you can always put the link to the group on yeah. your site that yeah. is always but I don't know how much you could integrate it directly in your in your Google sites but I, I will be doing more tutorials about Google Sites. I'm going to do a couple of tutorials about Blogger first, and then and I'm, from that I'm going back to Sites again to do a bit more. And that is one of the questions, one of the things I have to look into. Integration of this in general, maybe not just to Google Sites, but the first place you would think you could integrate it would be Google Sites, of course. Yeah, yeah. Or Blogger, since it is a Google product, just like most other pe people. So yeah. right now I am just learning. And as I learn, I will forward it to you. I will uh, also, I cool. think I will do at least one tutorial that's not a live stream about Google Groups by itself, do a video, because this was just a very quick look through what it is. But I yeah. think there is more to it than what I showed right now. So that will be coming too, eventually. Let's check with people in the... In the chat, I know you subscribed mostly because you are my friends. Hi, Granny. Welcome. I mean, uh, that's not the only reason. We did it. I mean, it's not the only, not the only reason, but a big reason. If you didn't I know mean, who I am, you. I mean, yeah, I get what you said. Just is one of the big reasons we did it, so. <clears throat> But, I mean, as I say every now and then, we will always support each other no matter what, so. Yeah. But I, I really think that Google Groups can be something valuable. Let's see what Ghana says here. This is, I want to make a coloring book. Someone suggested drawing YouTubers in our group to color in. Thoughts on the coloring book theme? Mm. Ghana, I don't know if, who would a coloring book be for? And are you planning on making a coloring book to sell? Or are you thinking, 
Are you thinking about making, when it comes to you, are you thinking about making a digital coloring book? Are you thinking about making a print coloring book? There are many questions. I don't know, Gunnar. I can't answer you. Yeah. Right. When I look at that, I think... You You're know, not late. It could, have, it could go either way, Gunnar. Up to you. Huh? Well. Harry's a suggestion, Gunnar. Hmm. And... Yeah. What did she say here? Let me see. People who want to cover. People who want to cover. I can make no, more than one. Printed cover. ones on Amazon. Okay. Yeah, and you know, there are a lot of adult color books. Out so you there. want to make print physically color by using. No. One question you also have to ask. Do you want to go by number or just random free color? Yeah, color by number. I mean, is it for kids? Is it for adults? I mean, I love coloring. Let me show you. I have these types. I use these types of coloring books like when I need to stress down and of course I just open the boring parts mm. where you just can you see? Yeah. This is my stress relief, coloring books like that. But that depends on who you are planning to do the color coloring books for. I agree, imagination is the limit for themes. But I think before you can set the theme, I think you have to set the audience and are we yeah. ready to let in drum roll do i have a drum roll no i must download the uh, drum roll if, so if, what are we giving him if it's the guy for last night don't let him shut in. it <laughs> did you hear your little intro here no i hear an intro You don't hear it? No. The boy. This is for. Do you hear that? Baby crying? I can barely hear it. It's not going mm -hmm. through your computer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can. And this is yours. So, tell me. Yeah. Opinions about my goodbye to you, Elsa? <laughs> 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 DJ pulled a squirrel on the squirrel last night. It was nice. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> it was nice. I was so some of the things I was thinking about last okay. night. Uh, I think Gina Bina come on too. Hi Gina. <laughs> hey, hey Gina. Oh, stuck in your hair and everything. So, I was thinking like you make like a group, uh, like a like a Google group where like, um, um, or like every week you could do like, like, like I'm talking all to, I'm talking all YouTube shit, you know. So like you like like kind of how we did like when we did the creator mm -hmm. um the creator f off. Do something like that if you just want to do something with your friends wherever you do something like we have yeah. like a weekly video that you all have to do for fun or uh you could you can make a group like that to just bounce ideas off each other 
Oh, looking for ideas for certain stuff. Um, it'd be a good group to put together with a bunch of people from a bunch of different niches. So say you come up with an idea, like, hey, I got an idea. Somebody should make, uh, you know, a fucking steak and kidney pie and show it step by step, you know? And then you can, uh, um, whatever whatever the thing may be, if it's out of your niche, you can put it in the group for people that are in that niche in case somebody needs an idea, you know? Um you do challenge videos or like, uh, um, I was thinking it'd be kind of cool to do like, if you got like four people together and you're like, all right, like every week you're going to do something. So it's going to, there's, there's going to be something in the video that's the same for everybody. Like there's an orange in the background somewhere or whatever it may be. And then you could hashtag the videos. Everybody has like some weird ass hashtag that nobody else is going to have, you know, like, I don't know, pink monkey butt fuckers or something, right? So mm. you put that, everybody tags their video with pink monkey butt fuckers. And uh, so then you could do a thing with like your, like each channel would have a fun scavenger hunt that they could set up. So they could be like, you know, say it was the four of us, we're like, you know, fucking, uh, you know, here's the hashtag. Go watch the videos. What's the same about all the videos? I don't know. I, I'm still in the infancy, but I just thought it'd be kind of cool that you could, you could all work together and do some creative stuff, and then you could all use the material with the hashtags to do like fun things with your uh, whoever. I don't know. <laughs> uh, what you what you can do when when you set up the groups, you can actually decide if people can attach files you can also have a group that say that you have a group that um, one topic where you can get help with general help with videos and i have an intro that i'm not happy with uh, and i can't figure out what i need to change i can yeah. attach my video and people uh, <coughs> ask uh, people come with suggestion what to change, what I can do to improve. I mean, there is a lot, a lot of possibilities. I think with this. Yep, I agree. But I think, I think it's kind of cool, you know. I said, don't know yet where it's go. Hmm. What do you say, G? I'm looking down. Hello, down there. Can you hear me? Talking to me? Oh, Gina. You said Gina, right? No. Gina. I thought she oh. said Gina. Gina, yeah. No, Gina. Gina. Not Gina. Gina. Do you want to know? No, Gina. I'm pointing at you. It's fucking Gina fucking Bina right here. What do you think about all this? Well, mm -hmm. it's pretty easy to um, request a thing to you, so I don't think it's going to be that difficult. Depends on what you want to share. I'm in a group like this. It's called no, Naked Dogs. But that's 1.2. But that's true. Sure. It was very easy to set up. Pictures of naked dogs. You share naked dog photos? Yes, yes, absolutely, I do. Yep. Well, my, my dogs, dogs, my my fucking my, dogs, naked my right dogs now, can't be in, in that group. Now you put sweaters on those little bastards. Ours or... don't show their nakedness of him. No, we about? little. Have you ever seen our dogs? No. They're giant. What kind of dogs do you have? We don't have no small dogs. Well, what kind of dogs are they? I'll be the judge of that. A German Shepherd. A male of German. What? German Shepherd. Yep. And the other one is a mix of German Shepherd and. Mm hmm. A point really? of, uh, of some oh, kind. That, then we have a super mutt. 
You talking about DJ or one of your dogs? So. <laughs> and then I had. I'm talking about one. one. So then here is mine. I has he's passed away now. <clears throat> mine he was he was big. Mine. He's a mix of uh, some kind of shepherd and uh, Australian Kelpie. He was right. hundred and he was a big boy, bro. Like if he, I miss him a lot. Mm -hmm. I think my internet is wonky. Yeah, it seems to let you yeah, in yeah. and out. You're like some, I don't know. I'm going in and out, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're like, you're like, a, you're like a fucking Swedish cyborg yeah, right I now. Yeah, I think my What's going internet on? is. One by one, it goes Gina. See you, Gina. Oh. Yeah. Watch out. Hey, listen. Pia's connection got better as people leave. So, DJ, you can leave now, me? and Pia'll be a better connection. Yeah. No. <laughs> <Can't be laughs> <too easy. laughs> yeah. Well. <laughs> oh, DJ. Let me see. Yeah. I'm gonna go into here. Mm -hmm. See how it looks here. So many people I, would. I have actually it. ordered. Down here where we are. Yeah. Down here where we are. <coughs> our welcome, internet welcome back, Gina. that we have in the house is My not that. My camera went out. Like, it went dark. I'm new to this. <laughs> so what? <laughs> Why? It's a text. So we have Cox down here, internet, and yeah, what do you have down there? Good, but on my phones, I have T-Mobile, Cox. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you heard me right. <laughs> you, you free, and it's, you freeze, it's you, not that good. You, you, your picture freezes up, and so does your sound every time you say Cox. It just stops. <laughs> <laughs> You're just like Cox. Yeah. And then it goes back. How? Uh, how? Oh, after I say it. Okay. Uh, so I have T-Mobile on my phones, and they have just started a Wi-Fi home internet, five G Wi-Fi right. home internet. So I have, I have ordered that. C O X. C O X. C O X. So I have ordered that. It should be coming in next week. So we will see. Hopefully I get a little better internet. Everybody was, in this area I is was complaining. Distracted. I was distracted. Did you just say that you ordered Cox? No, we have Cox. Oh, you have Cox. You don't need more Cox. Mm -hmm. No. Nope. you need less Cox? Yep. Oh. Okay, Tony. <laughs> Hi Dorito. Hey Dorito, you should have just in time. We're talking about Cox. <laughs> oh, what the fuck, this is not Hi Dorito. Hmm. Dorito. Yeah, but Pia, I do it with me. I mean, <laughs> we have like Comcast down where I am, and it's not the Best. So me and my family. Comcast is okay, but they so darn expensive. Yeah. Yeah, we we actually <laughs> sign it up for, <laughs> for that Salt Lake internet. Yeah, screw you too, but <laughs> <Tony. laughs> <laughs> but you know, we down here in this area, we didn't have any alternative. There is, 
There is C O X. What does it say, Gina? I can't tell. Squirrel. Yeah, Gina says squirrel. Doesn't say Cox. <laughs> Squirrel Cox. <laughs> yeah, I know, Gana. You really have potato. Yeah. Mm. But we we didn't have anything to choose from to start when we moved down here and so we forget about this internet down here so when t-mobile come with 5g wi-fi satellite it's not that bad it's 50 dollars a month for unlid so i'm gonna try yeah. it i hope it comes in next week so i can set it up and see 50 bucks a month. It's worth Man. a try. Yeah? Yeah. That yeah, well, that's not how it is. Top of your phone plan. Wireless, yeah. I guess so. Yeah, on top of my... It it's, goes on the same bill, but it's separate from my phone bill. Uh, yeah. yeah. And it eliminates the cocks so, all the way around. But I mean... But it's worth it okay. if it works. I mm -hmm. mean, and it's no contract, so you can cancel it whenever you want. So nice. I get the first month free, and I can cancel it right away if it doesn't meet what I need. Cool. <laughs> Is that what you want, Ghana? Unlimited squirrel cocks? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> we do not need that type of I don't know about that. Cox is very unstable, so I don't want to know if I would like unlimited squirrel cocks. That would be. That would probably be worse. Mm. Okay, I will let you know. I will let you know. Now Tony is frozen. Now he's yeah. unfrozen. He's just muted. No, I'm not. Oh, he's frozen. God. Oh, uh, that that whole thing just got too funny. It got too funny when you got done explaining, and you're all done. And you're like, <laughs> you're like, does that sound good? And then I was like, this pause. I think I was probably still processing information more than likely at this point in the night. And DJ just like, cool. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that is. That's, I guess that's really the right word for the moment. And then the cock started flying, and I just lost it. <laughs> <laughs> there was a lot of cocks coming out of your mouth and I had to fucking mute myself I was like whoa she is going all in <laughs> we're gonna lose it <laughs> oh shit <laughs> DJ what yeah cool. I don't I don't uh, think you need some more sleep Tony uh, you think I do I slept very well last night yeah if you I'll have you now if you laugh that hard or at Cox. Look at Gina's laughing. You see Gina over here? Over here. Look at her. She's fucking laughing around. So yep. See? Apparently you need more sleep, Gina. Just telling you. That's what I was just told. <laughs> I'm reading the chat, too. <laughs> Maybe if I stopped fucking chain smoking the vape pen over here, I'd be okay. I you guess. think flying cox package? Oh boy! You think it would be that easy to make you to be okay? No. See, Gana says I'm laughing pretty hard at cox too. <clears throat> Is that two cox? Wait a minute, did I read that right? I'm laughing pretty hard. At, oh, I'm at glad too, I can. <laughs> I just feel bad that we're keeping DJ awake. He's trying to fall asleep up there, but 
DJ, yeah, wake up. I'm awake. I know. I can hear any snoring. Let's wake him up. Oh, I did. It was well, definitely a... I mean, I'm super close to my mic right now since I'm on my iPad. Oh, I got you. I got you. So if yes. I blow into the mic, will it actually make your make your hair move around your ear? No, because I don't have any earphones on. If oh, and you don't have much hair on your ears either, I suppose. All right, screw it. It was a bad idea, right, DJ? I apologize. No, all garbage idea. What? All his hair is yeah. on his chest. That's yeah. That's why yeah. you wear no shirt. Yep. I would. DJ. We know that. I mean, I would disagree with that. Most of the hair on me is on my back. Oh. When you started with a B, I thought you thought you were going balls. I'm glad you went back. That was good. Um, <laughs> I, re I really did. I, I could imagine that because uh, I use that line a lot. I realize lately when I'm on fucking stream, when I'm about to spin a tale of imagination. I always say, yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine that DJ probably, uh, you know, when he takes vacation from YouTube, he grows out a little goatee and then he cuts it off right before he comes back. And super glues the hair onto his nipples. <laughs> Have you seen how hairy this guy's nipples uh, are? No, no. I mean, if you have anyone I know, I have to say. At least once a week, I did not like to have the full beard and mustache. I have to be. Free. Well, go for it. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you, Why? you see this half-assed mess I got going Why? on here. You, you know, don't. This, this you don't worry. I don't want to fucking shave. You don't worry about shaving your chest. <laughs> most, most what is people, going on? <laughs> most people don't see my chest. I mean, as long as I don't tune into fucking YouTube, Excuse I guess. Excuse. <laughs> Excuse me, most people don't see your hairy share channel, but on my channel, on which channel, yes, channel, you flaunt it, my young man. Yeah. That's, that's right. P was going to so take me to the channel. I don't know about that. It's true. Okay, most. Well, People in my everyday life don't see it. So, <laughs> but most people that go live streams late at night see your hairy chest. Yeah, and <laughs> am I right or am I right? <laughs> No, I, but <laughs> you, I mean, you did get a good day. Most people who watch your, your channel, mine or Will's, they're the same five to ten people. So, <laughs> no oh, you better. You better shush. Uh, whoa. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, be careful. You can't you can't unmute him that fast. You can yeah. what? <laughs> make it make it making noises. You. Of course I can. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Telling us that it's the same five to the people. Damn it, DJ. 
am I long? So let me ask you guys, do you think I should... Do you think I should do a more in-depth tutorial about Google Groups? Yeah, I definitely should. Um, how easy is it to remove people from those groups? Gina? <laughs> Why do you want I to just remove showed it. It's really easy. Oh, so you you click on it, you, you click on an X. Okay. Well, because I'm thinking, no, I'm really I thinking about putting together. Like, I I'm deleted really it myself. Of... Right, but you were showing how to by how, like you didn't actually do it. But you were showing how with Gina's name, right? Mm -hmm. So I was fucking paying attention. All right, once mm -hmm. in a while I do pay attention. It's not often. It's not often. It's not bullshit each other. Mm -hmm. I had a lot of you. Once in a blue but, moon. Excuse me. Excuse me. You. What's Should I? Fucking <laughs> guy. <Okay>. Anyway. <laughs> He's back. He's fucking back. But I was thinking about He's like. Back. I think I think it kind of would be cool just to make like a YouTube group. You know, you get your ideas out there. You can collab. You can set up collabs. Just make make a big fucking mm -hmm. YouTube group. You know. And uh, not a big one, but make a sizable one. Just kind of find some cool people to throw in there and see what we can see what we can get done, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm gonna keep on working on the ones I set up now. The two, I think you are limited to two. I don't know if you have, have this business account that can. Do more, probably do not more, sure. Yeah. I have to look into things like well, that. Probably, because yeah, I see something, something more for... No, but I think this is something that companies can use. Say that you work at a... Work with clients. You do advertisement and you work with different clients. You can have one group for each client you work with or things like that. So I think for business, I think this could be really good. What is Gunnar saying here? Why does it take so long okay. for my... Here, if we all work together, we could do so much on YouTube. Sure. Yep. Great again. Absolutely. Very, very true. Make I had an idea early on sure. and I never got uh, there. What's that? Hey, listen, are we doing a fucking YouTube cookbook this year? It's huh? time. It's to get to group, to get to group to really be successful and effective, I think it's up to. I mean, if you are a few people that start a group, so you are one owner and a couple of moderators, so you can get it, the ball rolling, I think it can be, it can be mm -hmm. effectful. But if you start a group mm -hmm. on your own, I was going to check here because it looks like my internet is a little better right now. So let me look at, and I will come back to you. When I you see up the results, the yeah. internet meter on the wall. What oh, the internet meter? Uh, fucking cranking right now. What? <laughs> I don't know why mine is. Uh, let me see. Okay, <laughs> here now I can share this. It, it has woken. up up a little bit here you see I search for all groups and messages YouTube there are 8,290 groups matching that query yeah, but if I click I here and watch all out. let me give let it give it a little bit. here None post in the last 30 days. None post, none post in the non post. 
these are groups that haven't posted so most of them are dead groups all right so i think it's pretty hard to get a group active if you're not putting a lot of time into it Yeah, Here's true. a group that right, I yeah. should join. There you go. Google helpers. Banned content warning. Oh, no. Back to safety. I'm not joining that group. <laughs> back, back to safety. <laughs> he is like, back in the fucking boat. That, Let's go. <laughs> We're getting out of here. That, back to the boat. Oh, what is this one? YouTube layouts. YouTube ah, layouts. No conversation. Oh, you have to today. ask. No, you have. You have to ask to join the group. It didn't have, so I can't see no conversations. YouTube <laughs> layout. YouTube fan finder. Oh, that's probably. Sub for subgroups. Oh, probably. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm afraid yeah. of. Is that, like, if I decide to start up a group, you know, and I share it around a little bit, if the wrong people get in, they're gonna be like, "Oh, check out my new fucking video. Hit me up. Leave a comment. I'll subscribe to you." That kind of bullshit. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's what what I think. If you get a group with a substantial number of members, you must have. I mean, if I sh say that I should make Pizza Pia grow, I know that the group I have there now, you could all be moderators and help me kicking out people like that. But by yourself, it can be really hard. What's this? Right. YouTube video viral. You have to be a member. Most of them you have to be a member. But you right, see how yeah. many that's not posting. It's like crazy. Well, you should be, I'll, bet, I'll bet you can uh, – can, um, can you sort the list and remove inactives? I'll bet you can somehow. I probably could somehow, but – yeah, um... Or I could search by conversations because those are things that are mm – -hmm. Hero wow. conversations Ooh. that's going on. June twenty eighth. Problem with YouTube again. Extreme. Oh yeah, you got so YouTube. If I, YouTube. They're gonna get all kinds. So of if search. I so if I search by conversations, I see groups that you something could, is happening in. You could search by yeah. people's names as well and see if there's groups about them or groups that they host. Right, Let's like, see. You know, if somebody if somebody come and put Pixel P in, your mm -hmm. stuff comes up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you go one. <coughs> yeah, ain't nothing about me. Right um, squirrel. Let's search for squirrel. <coughs> how do you how do you say? Two squirrel groups. L I C W squirrels, three hundred of them, and squirrel army. Yeah, that's a bunch squirrel of hill squirrel. parking project, squirrel app, squirrel state machine, Harry squirrel, squirrel productions, uh, squirrel ooh. lang, squirrel nursery, squirrel devices connect. Fuck you, Ghana. Well, I'm sorry. There are uh <laughs> See you, Charlotte. Bye. Bye. Hey, Granny. Be good. There Be are a lot squirrel. of squirrel. Old squirrels. Here you go. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that would be great for Tony. Oh, nobody has written in here since 2015. Uh too bad. The latest. Well, I don't think I'm going to join that one. <laughs> so you see, this is not, this uh, Google Groups is not something new. You saw that. 
2015. 2014 yeah. were those. Didn't even yeah, think about I that. Yeah. Them, they were actually 2010. So that they started groups, yeah. If you I go think into the I Google, uh, saw that somewhere too. So it's crazy. The, the little Google boxes they have up top, and it brings down all the apps, or all the programs. If you go through that and then get on the bottom and hit list more, and it lists more, <laughs> nowhere in there is Google Groups. You actually have to look for it. You have to search for it. No, I will show you where you find it. Let me see here. Google uh, ecosystem. Let me go to the site here. Here. I'm done. Done fired. P. Let me share this. Yeah. Here at about.google.com, you have all the products. And first, they have a little telling about telling about, for example, safer. Then they have accessibility and so forth. But if you scroll down here, Google products, and here you have all the Google products, and you have uh, Google uh, groups uh, right here. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, yeah, it's there. But what I'm saying is if you go on the main, like on Google.com, and they have like the apps up in the corner, and then they have more apps. It's not in either one of the first two. That's all I'm saying. No, because so you do you know how many apps? Find it. Let's count them. Do together. you know how many apps and services they have? Let me see if I can um, find that well, website now. Too many to count. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, way too many to count. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Fucking, what are you doing? See if I find that. Are you talking mm -hmm. to a chicken? <laughs> no, the chickens are out there. All I got is the squirrel. But he's got a squeaker too. So, <laughs> your dog didn't steal it yet. He's got he's got red eyes, like pinkish eyes. I don't yeah. Here is a page that had listed two hundred and seventy three, <laughs> but that's not all of them. Two hundred seventy three. Google uh, apps and services. Two hundred and seventy-three and services, but they do all kinds of shit, right? Yep. Like, can you get insurance through Google? Yeah, Is there, I think I think there's Google insurance. I don't know. There's I Google real estate, know. right? Might be. There is. I, like how you dodge I mean, I like there how is crazy, the crazy. Yeah. This is two hundred and seventy. I don't know if you can get insurance. What do you think I am? Google expert? Yes. I'm to save this to my keep. And there I did with a label. Google system. Mm -hmm. Let me see. If they... <clears throat> insurance... I will soon tell you. I don't know if they're still doing it, but they were in insurance in like 2016. They invested $13 billion in it. Uh, yeah, I don't I just ended up on, on their employee insurance and everything. They offer right. quite a good... I mean, I wouldn't mind working at any... Google. They don't sell any kind of insurance, though, right? Like, there's not ins like any kind of insurance at all. They do. They okay. do real estate. To, you, you go I, home. I don't know. You go home. 
Mm. I still yes find for health insurance for employees and stuff like that. Okay. What well, they need to Googlers offer. employee. But you know, I'm I'm getting more and more into my Google ecosystem here. So today I learned how I can use my little oh no my little Google thing here to turn on and off my TV and find the program program I want to see. So now I don't even need to use my remote. I do it with my little Google dot. <sighs> cool. I'm getting deep into the Google ecosystem. You're so I think I must start in. planning for renaming my channel. There you go. Be a Google. Yeah, Google with Pia. What? Google Pia. No, Pixel Pia. Yes. It. Just Google it. <laughs> I can have that as my official name. Just Google it, you said, right? Yeah. I don't know yet if yeah. I can have that yeah. as my official. Just Google it. Yeah, just Google it. <laughs> and if you do that, have you ever tried to Google? Google Pixel Pia. I no, you can. It's I can. A, it's, it's, I can be a it's Pixel been a hot Pia. Minute, I'll tell you that. And then can be instead of internet for beginners. I. Can... It's been a hot minute. It's been what? It's, it's been a hot minute. Breaking since I've done up. It. I'm breaking up. Hot. I would talk to you. Who's breaking up? Yes. That's what I thought. I can hear you guys clear the whole way through. You are. Okay. What? Uh -oh. I'm breaking up here. P is praying. Oh, you moved. Hand on chin. Bye, guys. Bye, DJ. Oh, goodbye, DJ. There you go. Did you one say bye? One. Bye, DJ. You're picking them off one by one, Pia. Uh, Goodbye, DJ. What I said was, I will... I will still keep my channel to just Pixel Pia City. No. But I would uh, have a subtitle internet for beginners have just google it when i get enough of google app tutorials so that's the majority of my channel freezing up Ooh, it's not me it's pia you're frozen. this is really bad right now pia it's you it's not it's not me it's you what's up frank what are you doing No, I go into my. If I go in check stream, it's excellent. Yeah, sounds excellent to me. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Every like three seconds, your your enough. picture up, your I'm picture like up, it, yeah. updates. No. Uh, update wake <laughs> I was mimicking every time your picture froze I was doing the same face and your face froze like that so I was doing this that's the way your face froze. Google's messing with you, Pia. Yeah, you keep freezing. Hmm. 
the fuck is going on? Jesus, is... fuck. Hi. That's a little cat. My whole house is dark. I'm sitting in the fucking living room. My mom's sleeping in the other room. Nobody else is here. I'm just sitting here. The house is quiet. The only thing I have on is a computer screen and a ring light. The whole rest of the house is dark. And out of nowhere, Frank comes fucking jumping. Lands right behind the ring light. Running over. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> he goes again. I, he's got to be. He must see something. I don't know. He's chasing something, but then he just disappears into the dark. I don't know what's going on. Might be a bug. Yeah, well, good. I hope he fucking catches it. He will. <laughs> he does a good job. Oh, he something. I hope the bug don't fly, Nanny. <laughs> Is he a mouse, sir? Fast. Huh? I, I don't know. I haven't. What are you doing? Do you go no, I'm me? like, it says no. excellent connection. I don't know why I keep on. Uh, I don't know. I did not see him. <laughs> I'm waiting to see if Frankie jumps on you. <laughs> I, I'm nervous right now. I'm like, he's going to fucking claw the shit out of me. He's going to use my back like a lot of... <sighs> you know the cat that went crazy on me? That, really went live? nuts. And they said on? when they... they What life? No, this was years ago. Uh, I was asleep and woke up in the middle of the night and had to go out to the kitchen and drink water. So I went out and the cat was sleeping next to me in bed. Went out, drank my water, was going back into my bedroom. And he just <laughs> wouldn't let me in the room. And I bent down, sat down and tried to talk to him, calm him down and... Just as I stood up, he jumped. Luckily, I was standing up when it happened because otherwise I would have had him in my face. He got his claws into my legs so deep, so I had to pull him off my leg. All four paws, yes. So I had to pull him lost leg by leg to get his claws out of my leg. And he was just, he kept on trying to attack me. So I had to grab a coat and leave my apartment. I couldn't go to bed. He was nuts. And the next day I went home again. I went to my parents' house and spent the night there. The next day I went home again. And luckily he loved his travel basket. So I sneaked in, made sure he wasn't close to me, grabbed his travel basket opened it and put it just inside the front door and i had glass on the side so i could see what happened and as soon as i had left that by the front door he ran into his travel basket so i in quickly and closed it and i had to take him to the vet and put him and they believe that he had a brain tum tumor that had kept on growing and at one point, it just made him lose it. But that was scary. And I still have on my leg deep scars where I had his claws sitting in my leg. Wow. Holy shit. It's, it was yeah. scary. It was scary. Man. And just like that, from laying next to me purring and me going out getting a glass of water and then he has monster that was so scary that was my that's last what, I cat mean, i couldn't even imagine that's that's so much pain i play with the cats and the cats dig in a little bit and you're like ah son of a bitch you know like mm -hmm. a, a cat was actually attacking but i'm i also i mean <clears throat> pulling the, i don't know i don't know 
I don't know. I like animals, but animal attacks me. That's it. It's game on. That's it. I'll just break your neck. Mm -hmm. I'm done. You know, that would have been the end of it for me. But I couldn't even take him. I had to lure him into his basket to get him to the vet and put him to sleep. That's fucking crazy. He was crazy. He was, he asked like, it was sad. It was a nice cat, big, nice cat, but what can you do? That's crazy. Talk about an emotional roller coaster. This is for crazy both of you too. too. Because now I mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I, I, I mean, wasn't had... in there when they put him to sleep. Yeah. I gave them No, but you gave them the carrier and said You got attacked by the cat, you had to state your parents or she had to get he just went nuts. You had to bring him and put him down. And the night before Mm-hmm. He attacked you, and you left your own house, and he thought, I fucking won. And the next day, he's like, ooh, I won again. I got my favorite little box, and he got inside. And then you pull mm-hmm. up to the vet, and he's like, fuck, I lost. I lost. Mm-hmm. He really lost. I don't think he was thinking that. I think he was just in so much pain, and that's what drove him nuts. Could be. It's... So now when you wake up in the middle of the night and you want to get up and get a drink of water or take a pee or something, do you second guess that? Like, I, maybe I shouldn't because... No. I'm going to try to get back in bed. The dogs are in the bed. And... No. Oh, none of our dogs would dare. Gosh, no. Yeah, my cats are... I know I would. Night. Mostly just Loki I would and Frankie knock them out. downstairs. But... Look, look, he's a cuddler. He'll come up there and he'll nuzzle right up against you and he'll get right in there and just lay there and he'll mm-hmm. stretch out along your body and he'll just purr himself to sleep. And he'll wake up hours later and he'll still be laying there up against your lamp. That's how this cat was. That's how this cat was until he lost it. Yeah. And just well, went that's, nuts. That's too bad. I mean, that's uh, mm-hmm. psycho cat story. After that, my, ne- my next animal was a rabbit. Hmm. A little yeah. calmer. Yeah. And then it been, it's been dogs after that. So. Yeah, we got the two cats. We got our dog and then my mom's dog. And then uh, uh, we got a lizard. Got a lizard. We have no. thousands of lizards around the house. Oh, not yeah, inside, yeah. luckily. Yeah, this is a big one. It's a uh, bearded dragon. She's cool. Bearded dragon. Hmm? Yeah. Yeah, she's if a I ever, I If I ever got a pet again, I would like to have a ferret. Ferrets are cool. They just stink like piss all the time. Mm-hmm. No matter how, no yeah, matter how but, clean you keep them, they stink like piss. That's like mm-hmm. their natural but they thing are to give off darn, that caramel. But they are so darn funny. Oh, they can be, and they can be little fuckers too, and they can be mean. But it all depends on how you raise mm-hmm. them. If you raise them good, yeah, you know, you'll have good pets. But the the that pheromone spreading is a little too much for me. I have I a, a had skunk. a friend in Sweden that had two ferrets and a um, not Doberman, a um, what's the other big one? Rottweiler, a Rottweiler uh, and two ferrets. And the ferrets, they were they were funny, his ferrets. They used to ride on the uh, dog's back. They climbed up on him and sat on his back. They were so darn funny. And yeah, then they wanna... like to sneak in your arms, in your sleeves. Yeah. And stick their yeah. head out at the end. They were... Yeah, my, my buddy yeah. had one, and he would climb all over the house. And if you came mm-hmm. in there and you were sitting there in baggy shorts, he would climb up in one leg and come out the other leg. I'm going to tell you, mm-hmm. I didn't trust the little vermin. And he would climb up inside your shorts, and I'd be like, oh, my God, he's going to bite me. And then he'd climb out the other side. Like, I don't like him so much. And he bit a couple dudes, and that's why I didn't really like him. But, you know, but every time it was kind of, you know, shady handling of the ferret, so you can't really blame him, you know what I mean? Drunk people touching no. him, and then he bites him and says, fuck off. But either way. But Pia, how do you say squirrel in Swedish? Mm, Ekkore. 
Uh, what is it? Ekore. Ekora. I will write it in the chat. Oh boy. I have a little Ekora song. Ekora. There's a song? A song. Ekore, Ekore, Vifta Posin Swans. Ekore, Ekore, Vifta Posin Swans. Plockar up and hassel net. Then I forgot the rest. Rinker Posin Nuso Sert. Ekore, Ekore, Vifta Posin Swans. It's squirrel, squirrel, with, uh, he's uh, wagging his tail. Yeah. Squirrel, squirrel, wagging his tail, picking up a ha hazelnut, and he's uh, drinker. Mm. He does this nose thing they do, like. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. <clears throat> on his sweet nose, and that's the song. Huh. That's pretty cool. Thank you. That's amazing. How the fuck I've known you this long and didn't know there was a squirrel song in Swedish. I don't know, but oh yeah, uh, I can I can write it down yeah. for you and send it to you. Again, I also did. It was right after the pause, if I'm correct, right? Me too. Which one could it be? Ekore, ekore, viftar på sin svans. Go. On. Ekkore, ekkore, viftar på sin svans. Plockar upp en hasselnöt. Rynkar på sin nos och söt. Right there. Right there. Ja, oh, rynkar. No, no, say the whole line. Rynkar på sin nos så söt. It sounds like you're saying drinker pussy. Right? <laughs> Is that what you're hearing too? Right. Gina yeah. heard it. Gana heard it. it. That's what it sounds like when you. That's why we were all like, "Well, we heard some bad words there," but uh, but it's not. It's uh, it's Rinkar, and then what's the second word? Uh, I can't. Poor. P poor. and a with a circle. Rinkar po sin nose. Sin nose. Oh, nose. that's the nose thing. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Okay. So sweet, so sweet. Huh. So cool. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad that was a drinker pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I will write it down for you and phonetically too how to say it. Uh, you have you have a special email folder just for me. Uh, you can yeah. send it. You go in that folder and find an email for me and just respond. That'd be beautiful. Mm -hmm. I like that I have my own folder. I, 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 told you I, I, I will do that. I will do that. <sighs> so, I actually forgot about that song. I don't use Swedish so often, so I need to think when you ask me questions like that. That's crazy how yeah. fast you like get that. When, when you stop thinking in a language, you have to start translate in your mm -hmm. head and that's i should really start making those shorts again about swedish expressions you i should. did they were fun and You're now cheating. when you have yeah, the camera oops sorry now that you have the camera built in it would be easy to make them i have a short channel i could put them on mm -hmm. Yeah, the cameras on these phones are amazing nowadays. Mm -hmm. And I mean, with the YouTube shorts, it's so easy to just... And they're right there. Yep, it's true. Because we have quite a few fun expressions in Sweden. When you translate them, they're fun. Yeah. You can talk about so. just the ones I know. You got the... Well, there's the pussy thing we just talked about. And then um, you could you could you could you could do a whole thing on Hayes on Hay, so people know what that is. Hayes on Hay. Hayes on Hay. And then you could do uh, uh, my, what is it? What is goodest? My, is, that what it, is that right? Lord as goodest. My yes. husband loved. My husband loved when I said Bratak. What is that? 
I gotta tell you, I kind of like that. What is it? <laughs> Bratek. If if you ask me how how are you, I answer Bratek. Well, thank you. Huh. Bratek. It's kind of painful. I could imagine the attack and the brow be. Mm -hmm. so i should really put them up i mean when it's so easy with the shorts camera when i think of something i could just record it right there and then yeah. right exactly yeah you could be they are funny. whatever you know i have i actually have some of my old ones i did on that channel let me Some see. Some of your which old uh, Swedish shorts? Yeah, I made them into shorts. Let me see. Switch account. Where is it? Here. I have. Uh, I have content. I have. One, two, three, four, five, six videos up there. I have uh, Slang the Veggen. Uh, I have Rund under Fötterna. I have Ingen Ko på Isen. Hålla Tummarna. Skägget i Brevlådan. And Tala om Trolle. That's uh, six expressions and I uh have what i mean in english what I, not what i mean yeah i tell you what i mean but what <laughs> is the correlating expression in english too you didn't know i had that no i should i didn't know either i thought you had i should actually no i have it uh let me see dashboard. What the work? Channel. No, not my channel. What am I doing? I can't go to my short channel because I'm a manager of it. Settings. What? No. Mm -hmm. I'm in studio and I'm trying to go to channel as a and I am my own manager now I found it here I'm gonna post it in the chat if you want to learn a little Swedish these I did a long these are short videos I did a long time before YouTube even thought about creating shorts. That's how long it has been. That channel has been there. I think the last one I uploaded was, let me see, October 2020. Oh. It's he like. Pete's got the fucking pink hair, she's got the lemons. You see, it's a long, long time ago. Yeah, I see that now. And these were originally... I don't know if I did them for TikTok or something and never put them there. And then I found them on my computer and I said, let's just put them up somewhere. So that's how life goes. Guys... Huh. Guess what? Round we have reached the two hour mark again. All right. I gotta go to bed. And yeah, I have. I'm, I'm getting a little round under the feet. You're getting a little round under the feet? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're getting. Rund under, rund under fetina. There you go. That's what I meant. And you have yeah. to have the rolling R's. 
rund ja. under fötter nu. That's the hard part. Yeah. No, but since it's late, it's time for me to switch camera angle. There we go. And, and you know what happens now. I'm going to play. Who knows what I'm going to play? So last night you didn't play anything. You said I'm going to play it. And then you said, fuck you. I'm not that girl. That's right. So you were gonna play last girl. Night. See, can you hear me? Last night. This is what happened last night. Pia can hear it. We can't hear it. And then she shuts down the stream. <laughs> See? <laughs> Why can't you hear it? Let's try again. We can. What happened? How'd you get so loud? Wow. I can hear myself in here. Your whole headset's way up. I can hear myself. Hi, Tony. Still oh, can't so cool. hear the music? No music. No. And Bob's your uncle. Let's see if you can hear it now. Now your volume's down. <laughs> Wait. Why doesn't this work? Because I... I hear something very, very low. Yeah, but it's not coming through the stream. It's coming through her head, her headset. Mm -hmm. She's got it up in a headset. We can hear it, but right now we can't enjoy it. And uh, she's going deaf. Can you hear mm -hmm. that? No. No. Why isn't everything else works? Could you just sing a song for us? Sing the squirrel song. How much? Ekkorre, ekkorre, vifta på sin svans. Ekkorre, ekkorre, vifta på sin svans. Plockar upp en hasselnöt. Vinker på sin nos och sät. Ekkorre, ekkorre, viftar på sin svans. That's tonight's entertainment. And remember, Bye, everybody. And remember, never, never stop learning. I did it right. Good night, tonight. everybody. You did. Hey, son. Hey. Hey, son. Hey. Have a good night, everybody. I'm out. I'm going to bed. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out.